Spin into action, unraveling the phrase. Hello and welcome, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the exciting world of English phrases. Specifically, we're going to explore the meaning and usage of the phrase, spin into action. This video will help you understand not just the literal meaning, but also how it's used in everyday English. So, let's get started. Spin into action is a phrase that combines two words, spin and action. To understand it, we need to look at both parts. Spin often means to turn or rotate rapidly. In our context, it doesn't refer to physical spinning, but rather implies a sudden or swift change in activity or behavior. Action, on the other hand, refers to doing something or being active. So, when we say someone spins into action, we mean they suddenly start being very active or busy, especially after a period of inactivity or waiting. To grasp this better, let's look at some examples. 1. As soon as the alarm sounded, the firefighters spun into action, ready to tackle the blaze. 2. After weeks of planning, the team spun into action on the day of the event, ensuring everything ran smoothly. In both examples, the phrase illustrates a quick transition from a state of readiness or preparation to active engagement in a task. Suitable contexts. This phrase is often used in scenarios involving emergencies, quick responses, or initiating projects. Variations. You might hear variations like spring into action or leap into action. These have similar meanings but differ slightly in intensity and imagery. Avoid misinterpretation. Ensure that the context supports the idea of suddenness and activity. Using spin into action in a slow or gradual context might confuse listeners. Spin into action is a dynamic and vivid phrase that adds color to our language, especially when describing swift and decisive actions. I hope this video has clarified its meaning and usage for you. Keep practicing, and soon you'll be spinning your way through English conversations with ease. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next language adventure.